I've been a few issues in my time, I must admit. Some are more unusual than others. Some I'd like to forget. Um, but generally speaking, when you're in a when you're in a band for 16, 17, or 18 years, you you get to talk to quite a few different kinds of people, and that's kind of an insight into how the world works, actually. And John, I, it's Suzanne here. I was the one that sort of came and ambushed you and, and sat with you at the, at the bench. And you're right, it was really sunny. And I remember you bringing out a lovely tray of cool water with ice in it for us. And, um, you know, donkey's bottoms being by my head the whole time I was speaking to you. But I know you said you were flummoxed by the canoe at the time. Uh, I was completely, actually. It took me, it took me by surprise, but part, partly because I'd I'm not terribly good at um, those kind of games, actually. And so, can you call it a game? I suppose it is, yeah. Um, but anyway, we got there in the end, didn't we, I think? We re yes, we really did. We really did. So, um, what sort of year, looking back 2020, I know lots of people, you, you have to look all over social media, everyone are doing their 2022 reels. What sort of year has it been for you, sort of highlights? Um, well, I think the hi one of the highlights was at the beginning of the year in February. We, my wife and children went over to Cuba. Um, for two weeks, and that was fa absolutely fascinating, seeing a country which was, you know, completely frozen in time because of its, uh, its government, the socialist government there, and uh, and then this sort of amazing black market, of course, which was on the other side of the tracks, and uh, it was a very uh, fascinating and frustrating journey, but uh, in the end, I think we we learned to love Cuba, and the Cuban people were delighted, despite all their struggles with this uh, this uh, static situation, and uh, partly due to the Americans not behaving very well with them. We won't go into that, but now that was a fantastic trip, actually. And you know, um, other highlights for me was that uh, I had a book out which I wrote about the back of the band, you know, my life in dire straits, which. Mm. Uh, you know, was 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 a great thing to do, and and 2022 was when it was sort of going out all over the world. So I got to talk to some interesting people about that, mm -hmm. and, and um, yeah. And and if we pop into the East End Arms, are you getting your bass guitar out? Are you entertaining the locals with a few Dire Straits numbers? Well, now that might be telling. Um, I did actually do a few numbers with. Um, Hannah from my band last week in the pub uh, when we had a sort of a music evening. I'll probably do one um, uh, in January, I think, oh. just quietly. Oh, quite, oh, quietly. Okay, watch this space. It will happen at some point in January. Yeah. Uh, what Dire Straits song should we play, John? Um, well, I think Sultan's is, um, is the one to play, really, because it's got... It's got a great uh, sort of um, element of joy about it, and also it's quite a, quite a poignant song for musicians to listen to, you know, about the difficulties of um, being noticed. Um, and it was a great observation that Mark made about this, this pub in a, in a, you know, in, in which had this band in it in South London. That's, it stood the test of time, let's move that way, which is always a, always a pleasure. I love this song. I'm not just saying that, but I'm so glad you've cho chosen it. It's absolutely brilliant. Thank you so much for being a clue keeper and part of Clued Up this year. Yeah, and thank you for welcoming us um, to your pub as well. And uh, you never know, pop into the East End Arms, you never know, you might see John there <laughs> with his guitar. Happy New Year, John. Happy New Year. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Bye bye. <laughs> A shiver in the dark, it's raining in the fog in the meantime. Sound of the river, you're stopping your home, everything. A man is blowing Dixie, love of all time. You feel alright when you hear the music.
check out Guitar Charge. He knows all the chords. But it's strictly rhythm, he doesn't want to make them cry all soon. If they don't know guitar is all he can afford. When he gets up under the lights, play his thing. And Harry doesn't mind if he doesn't make the scene. He's got a daytime job, he's doing all right. He can play the home, don't bag anything. Saving it up Friday night. With the Sultans, with the Sultans on swing. And a crowd of young boys there fooling around in the corner. Drunk and dressed their best brown baggies in their platform so they don't give a damn about any trumpet playing band. It ain't what they call rock and roll. And the Sultans, yeah, the Sultans are playing Creole. Creole. to swing dive straight oh good to have john ilsley on as a kooky for this year and chat to him again today brilliant 